Welcome to Fast Performance TV, I'm Claudio Encina. Today we're in our dispersonality episodes and we're up to the letter S. As you've seen in our previous episodes on video, you would have seen the D, which is the driver, and I, which is the influencer. So today we're gonna to hone in on the steadiness type of personality and see how you can better connect and understand your clients in this marketplace today. You see, you're meeting a lot of people today at open homes and you may be doing a lot of appraisals and listing presentations. How can you win more business and how can you better connect with these people when you're out there in the marketplace and in the trenches? So one of the things that you wanna understand is the people that you're dealing with. So it brings us today to the S character, which is the steadiness. Firstly, a couple of characteristics that I'm gonna run through with you so you can get to understand a clear picture of what these people look like. Firstly, they're quite steady, they're quite predictable, they sit on the fence, and they don't give too much away. So already you're probably drawing some conclusion and going, that's the guy that sits in the lounge room when I'm sitting with him talking him about price and he just doesn't give anything away. And you walk back to the office and people in the office go, how'd that market appraisal go? And generally at that time and moment, you go, yeah, it went sort of really well. He sort of didn't give too much away. Um, I think I've got it. And then you get that phone call a week later and they say, Claudio, thanks so much for your time. But at this point, we've gone with another agent. And you think, well, hang on, I, I thought I connected with that guy. But in actual fact, we didn't because he didn't give too much away and you didn't know exactly where you stand. So you've got to understand these type of people. But here's a couple of things you may want to learn. The do's and don'ts of this type of character. So let's go quickly. The do's. Be patient in getting answers. Sometimes us as agents, we're impatient. We want the answers now. But these people, give them a bit of time. Sometimes it may even need a couple of days to get that answer back to you, okay? The other thing is, set a comfortable environment for these people. It could be around the kitchen table, for example, or in their lounge room, but set it a good environment for them. The more they feel they're comfortable, guess what? They're more likely to connect with you. The other thing is be calm in your approach and manner. So slow things down, okay? Talk slowly. Sometimes me, I get excited, as you know, I've got heaps of energy, but you've got to slow it down sometimes. So you can really start to connect with these type of people. A couple of the don'ts that you may want to look out for is don't be pushy with these type of people. Overly aggressive. Right now in this market, we're seeing a lot of that. And obviously, be too confrontational. You see, I remember a while back now, I remember speaking to a guy and he said, People love doing business with people who they feel most comfortable with. Think about that for a moment. People love doing business with people who they feel most comfortable with. So all of these series of videos that we've been sending you over the last couple of weeks is getting to better understand and connect with these clients so they can feel really comfortable with you. If you get to know and understand your client, they will do business with you. All right, I hope you've enjoyed our little video today. Remember, stay in control, stay focused, and always stay in action.